Hello everyone, what's up? It's Jonathan here with Infinite Potential Media and today we have the brand new, I think this is the first official trailer to Black Panther. Um, the one we got previously was just a teaser trailer, but first let's just talk about this new poster that's been released featuring the likes of Chadwick Boseman, Martin Freeman, Michael B. Jordan obviously, Andy Serkis, Forrest Whitaker, Angela Bassett, just to name a few. So apparently this trailer is very singular world. And what I mean by that is, it doesn't feel like it's very much connected to the rest of the MCU, which I don't hate. I mean, for example, we had Ant-Man and Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2, which weren't necessarily world-building films in the sense of the grand picture of the MCU, but we still got a lot of substance and some awesome, awesome storytelling. So, without further ado, I have seen one screenshot of this fucking trailer that I really didn't want to see. But unfortunately, the internet is a terrible place to try and avoid. So, I'm going to click onto the trailer. Oh, it's there again. That screenshot. And we are going to watch this. So, let's do this. Oh god, just coming straight on with it. Okay. I've seen gods fly. I've seen men build weapons that I couldn't even imagine. Wow. Uh -huh. I've seen aliens drop from the sky. Yeah. But I have never seen anything like this. Wow. Still love that logo. Oh, whoa. Even the slums don't look like slums. It is your time. Okay. Oh, wow. Whew. Freeze. I never freeze. Oh, what? <laughs> okay. Wow. What? I, I waited my entire life for this. The world's gonna start over. I'm gonna burn it all. What happens now determines what happens to the rest of the world. I still love this shot so much. Oh, wow. Oh! Oh my god! I love that gold suit. Oh my god, that suit is amazing! Still not sure on the eyes. Wow! That looks amazing. Um. The suit, I didn't actually realise that the suit just materialised like that. Um, still, like I said, not sure on the eyes for the suit. I, I get where they're going from, but it's really not what I like. Um, I much prefer the cowl of the first suit that we see in Civil War. And in this movie, there's an amazing shot in the trailer there. Of the two suits next to each other. It's very Batcave-esque. But then again... Uh, T'Challa is the richest superhero, I do think. Um, that looked great. Uh, we saw a lot more of <clears throat> the character of um, Angela Bassett there, who I think is portraying his mother. Let me just double check before I make a complete fool out of myself. Uh, yeah, Angela Bassett's playing his mother in the film. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. Um, we also saw a lot more of Michael B. Jordan in there who um firstly is once again in incredible shape for uh this role uh, it's, i don't think he ever dulled down after playing adonis creed um but he's playing um i, I read that completely wrong uh eric killmonger who 
in this trailer we see don that re that um really cool gold suit it looks epic um it's nice to see that that suit materializes just like the um one that t'challa wears um the entire scenery in this film the mise-en-scene really really do stick out as this individual film um you, you don't really see any alien-esque guardian sort of technology other than the ships and everything else looks very organic but it's still got that amazing ancient sort of vibe to it um so it's really nice that they can connect the two oxymorons there and just have everything look so natural um it looks amazing i don't really know what else to say i'm kind of blown away by that trailer and i feel like i've got to watch it at least two more times to catch a lot more that i didn't catch um just a few other people obviously we see martin freeman in there is playing everett ross who once again portrayed this character first in civil war we also see um do, 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 we saw yeah we did see andy circus as alicia's claw um we've not seen him for a few years now but uh, i'm excited to see him back he had that amazing wrist cannon in the trailer we saw there i can't wait for this film guys i didn't actually anticipate much going into that trailer as you could probably tell i wasn't looking that enthusiastic but coming through the other side of that now it just looks absolutely amazing and i cannot wait to see more what do you guys think about this trailer do you think that it lived up to the hype that everyone was hoping it would or do you think that it kind of fell short don't forget to leave those comments and opinions down below and subscribe for more content.